What's going on, Squirrel Squad? How we doing? I'm back. I'm at probably 70, 75%, but it might as well be 200%. I feel great compared to how I felt all week. I can breathe again. And I found some two Ronnies. So if you're new here, this might be the biggest database of two Ronnies reactions on YouTube, but it might not be either. I don't know. But I've got a lot of them. I've done almost 100 of them now, probably. Uh, who knows? I have no idea how many I've done, but it's been a lot. So it's four Ronnies Friday, which means I do two, two Ronnies. And guess what? I found two. I found four. So we're going to have it next week, too. Don't worry, guys. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. Send me any obscure ones you find. This is the Milkman speech. I have no idea what it's going to be, but I never do because that's uh, the whole point of doing reactions. Otherwise, I'd just have to sit here and be like, oh, yeah, I remember this. I remember this. <laughs> Let's give it a whirl. Merry, Merry Christmas to you all. <laughs> As I think of you, my loyal customers, sitting at home round your firesides this Christmas, it brings home to me very strongly the enormous responsibility that I have as your milkman. H.M. Quinn. H.M. Quinn. H.M. Quinn? I feel like that should be like, I think, feel like that's like a mean something. I just want to point out that uh, uh, when I was a kid, we had a milkman. And we had like a styrofoam lined, it was like an, a galvanized box outside the door. And I had like styrofoam on the inside to, to uh, help insulate it. But like milkmen were way outdated then. I'm 46. And even when I was like, like 6, 10 years old, milkmen, they were still weren't, even then they were kind of a thing of the past. But we had the local milkman. That we still paid to come to the house. My dad used to open up those bottles and pull out the cream from the top and the inside. Mm. And as we know, the tits will poke a hole in those. You think of that? I remember. I know you will appreciate how important it is to me to know that I have your support and shall continue to have your support throughout the coming year. The task of supplying milk to a great nation such as ours is, I am sure you realize, not an easy one. Either here at home or in our colonies, spread as they are like butter over the entire globe. I feel like this is what I was talking about. This is when Milkman was starting to die and people were just picking the milk up the store. So, kind of like what I was talking about, you know, this is that time, I think. I think. Whether home or colonial, it is our express wish that it be cooperative, uniting dairies across the world. The milk of human kindness must not be watered down. It must flow not only through the cream of society, but also onto the most humble doorstep in the land, be it black or white or gold top. <laughs> Let our lives be ordered, and ordered as soon as possible, so as to avoid disappointment <laughs> in the years to come. I extend my warmest and most heartfelt bottle to you all. <laughs> All right, Gold Top. I guess that's probably that was probably a brand back in the day. Gold Top. I don't know. Uh, how many dairy and milkman references did you count? They got they had to be like twenty seven of them in that minute and fifty seconds. That was <laughs> the cream, the butter, the milk, the the bottle. I mean, there was just so many of them, you know. And of course, the reminder to order early and order often because we want your business. <laughs> Oh, the milkman. The milkman cometh and the milkman leaveth and the milkman disappointeth. Or maybe not. I don't know. Uh, I know there are still people that still, there still is milkman service out there. Um, I know somebody who gets it. And uh, it's very, very expensive. They get it in half gallon glass bottles and it's like five ninety a bottle or something. Wow, it's crazy expensive. Uh, we pay like three bucks for a gallon at the store. Anyway. Uh, that was the Milkman speech. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope that uh, you'll stick around and come back later on for part two of Four Ronnie's Mother Effin' Friday. It's good to see you guys. I'm on the mend. Go back to normal next week. Scroll out. Mm -hmm.